Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to a video of mine, and today I'm going to talk about a problem I had with a Rock 64 and loading Diet Pie on it. Now, Diet Pie is one of my favorite operating systems, and the Pine guys that do the Rock 64 make a lot of super cool products that I enjoy. You hear my co-host in the background, that is Pebbles, the Quaker parakeet who's 22 years old, that I raised from a chick. So... Uh, right now I gotta thank Door to Door Geek from Podnuts, where I do the mini PC show, for sending me out a 4 gig o RAM, uh, Pine 64, Rock 64 board, and this board is way cool. But we're gonna go to the commercial break right now, I'm gonna thank my patrons from Patreon, starting with the guy who's pledged to me first, Andy Meows, John Hollinger, Umar Seer, Matt Champ, Token Linux guy and Ian Fox. All I'm asking for you guys is a buck a month, just and some input. And sometimes you get some deals and some leads on information that may be helpful to you or save you money. So if you subscribe and pledge, I greatly appreciate it. So to get started, you go to the Pines website, click on Rock 64, and you can see some of the specs on the board here. This is this is a real winner of a board. It gives you, I'm not sure what I'm circling first here because I, the audio didn't record when I initially did it. So you get gigabit ethernet. This board has four gigs of RAM, eMMC, uh, the eMMC isn't on it. You get USB 2.0 ports, two of those, and you get USB 3.0 ports. So I'm sorry I'm not doing this in the order of where I'm pointing because the audio didn't record when I did this. So... Super fantastic board, very excited to have it. So if you scroll down, and I'll wait for me to scroll down, to, uh, let's see, is it resources? Resources, yes. So under resources, they have software, and the Pine installer is a very excellent version of Etcher. And you can see here, it looks just like Etcher, but it is Pine. And you select the board that you have, and then the OS, and then the destination. So if your OS isn't listed, so it, it, it'll automatically pull them down and then install them. And if your OS isn't listed, like I'm doing here, you can go over to Diet Pie, click on the Rock 64, click Download, and download that file and then go to the app. So I already have the app spun up. I am gonna click use different Im image so you can see me actually uploading it. You select the board here, and I don't know why what Popcorn Hour Transformer is, but what the heck, it's the Rock 64, so let's go for it. As you scroll down, you're not gonna see the OS that you just downloaded, but you see the file browser. So the Diet Pie right there is the older version of Diet Pie. See, it's version 156. They have 160, actually 162 out now. So I'm just going to click Browse. I'm going to pull the what they call version 6.0, but it's going to update to 162. Type in your password, and you're going to see dots. So you don't get my password. I'm going to spare you the boring flash. I'll speed it up to like 24x, and boom, it's done validating. Yay. Okie doke, so we are done here, and alright, so when you load, uh, you're eventually going to run into this problem. It's going to tell you the boot file system does not have enough room, and it's basically going to be empty. So the solution is, that's where I burned it on my MacBook Pro, the 2012 Retina. And I'm going to drop it into the Unibody MacBook Pro running Ubuntu and Gparted, and literally drop it because I drop it. Uh, see, there it goes. Uh, but I'll pick it up and put it in, yay! Okay, so uh, right here what you do is you're going to have to click refresh, and as it refreshes... And yes, I skipped ahead, so you don't have to watch the refresh. So here's actually what's going on. You select the drive, or the partition, and then resize, and then just drag it as big as you want, and click resize. So it's successful. We grew the partition. And we will see right here. So now it's 790 meg. Oh, I'm sorry, I got that wrong. So it's 18 gigs unused. And we have now 
increase the size of the partition, and Diet Pie will work. Yay. And, and the evidence of that is on the screen here. Maybe, maybe it comes up. You can see I am running Rock 64 version 6.2, and it does work. 